hello everyone welcome back to motion mix 350 in today's video you are going to learn how to create this cool explainer video in canva using nothing but your smartphone open canva and go to mobile video and choose a blank canvas go to elements we are going to build our setup in the search bar type window go to graphics choose any image resize and reposition your image go back to elements in the search bar type counter table go to graphics and choose the image in the second column resize and reposition your image go back to elements in the search bar type hungry and choose the second image resize and reposition your image and then send your image to the back of the counter now let's animate our character go to animate and scroll all the way to baseline we are going to choose an animation called baseline and what you're going to do we are going to decrease the speed of our animation now let's go to our second frame go back to elements in the search bar type foam tap these three dots on your right hand side and go to animated after press done and scroll all the way to the eighth element or the eighth image bring your image onto your canvas resize and reposition your image or your element you can put it in the center of your canvas now let's give our canvas some color let's put some text to our frame go to text We'll use this pink glow text. Bring your text onto your canvas. Resize and reposition your text. You can now type your own text and start adding more text. Final project, create a new frame. Now let's animate our text. In the toolbar, go to animate. I think we'll choose this animation called past and then we'll increase the intensity of the animation and then tap on enter. We'll also animate the other text. For this text we'll use the wipe animation. Increase the intensity or the speed of the animation and then on enter. Create a new frame and go to elements. In the search bar type pizza delivery. Choose your image and bring it onto a canvas. Resize and reposition your image. Go back to elements and choose a square shape. Resize and trim your shape, your square shape. Now we are going to animate our shape. Go to animate in the toolbar and choose the wipe animation. Now we can increase the speed of our animation and then tap on both. Let's give our shape some color. Go to color in the search bar and then change the color of your shape. Go to text and then select your text. You can now type your text. Resize your text so that it fits into the shape. Animate your text, go to animate and then choose the wipe animation. Increase the intensity of your animation and set to both. Go back to text and choose a text box and type your text. Resize and reposition your text. Animate your text. Go back to wipe animation. Increase the intensity of your animation and set your animation on both. Duplicate your frame. Now we are going to change our text. You can type your text. Resize and reposition your text. Don't forget to change your other text. Duplicate the frame again. Repeat the process of changing your text. By now you should be having something like this. Create a new frame. Go to elements. In the search bar type payment tap on the three dots 
and go to animated. As we can see, we have different options, but let's go for the eighth graphic element. Resize and reposition your graphic element. Go to text and type your text. Let's animate our text. For this text, we are going to use the pulse animation. We could also increase the intensity of your animation. Now let's create another new frame. Go to elements. In the search bar type clock. Go to animated. Scroll to the seventh graphic element. And drag it onto a canvas. Don't forget to resize and reposition your graphic element. Go back to elements. In the search bar type food delivery. Go to animated. And choose your graphic element. Reposition your element. Go to text. Then type your text. Let's animate our text. We're going to choose the bounce animation. Increase the intensity of your bounce animation. And set to both. Create a new last frame. Copy and paste a graphic element from your second frame. Copy text from the second frame. And paste it to a last frame. Now we are going to add voiceover to our project. Go to upload. And in the upload section go to audio. We are now going to add our voiceovers according to our scenes. For voiceovers I use the website called ttsmp3.com. After you are done with your voiceovers you can now start trimming your frames according to your desired length. Now to tie everything together we have to add background music. Go to audio. In the search bar type advertising and choose the first song on the list. Are you hungry? Don't worry. Introducing Speedy Food app. You can select over 200 restaurants. Choose your food and add to the cart. Confirm your location. We have easy and convenient paying options. We have a quick turnaround time. Speedy app. Food at your fingertips. If you found value in today's video, like, subscribe, and comment. Until we see each other in the next one, peace.